Today, I'm gonna try something a little bit different. Everybody knows the same old debate about mouse and keyboard versus controller. Most mouse and keyboard players say that controller players have it easier because of aim assist and stuff, and most controller players, at least me, believe that mouse and keyboard players have it easier because, well, the mouse is much faster and more precise. That is my opinion, and to prove that, I'm actually gonna leave behind the controller for once and switch to mouse and keyboard to show you just how much better I will perform. And this video is impossible to fake because as most of you know, if you're not new to the channel, and if you are, then how you doing? Please subscribe. As most of you know, I am primarily a console slash controller player. Doesn't matter the game, 99% of the time I play on my PS5 with a DualSense controller. Okay, we're gonna start off with Battlefield 2042, obviously. I still can't believe that this is currently my most played game out of all the games, even though, you know, everybody remembers how it launched. And now it's actually in a state that I consider it's pretty fun. It's not a perfect game by any means. Hold up, I see a flying squirrel right there. Okay, my first kill with mouse and keyboard. As you can see, mouse and keyboard, this video is all about, uh, well, basically kind of proving that mouse and keyboard is way easier than controller. As you guys know, I am primarily a console slash controller player. Uh, I don't have a lot of experience with mouse and keyboard. The only real games I play with mouse and keyboard are LTS games like uh, Age of Empires and City Skylines and stuff like that. Uh, shooters I primarily play on the PlayStation with a controller. So this is gonna be interesting. Now, the only thing I kinda did... Wow, <laughs> okay. To be honest, this gun is pretty disgusting. But the only thing I kinda did uh, before I started this video was changing the keybinds because the mouse aspect of mouse and keyboard I can I can do pretty well in my opinion which is the most important part obviously but I often have miss inputs when it comes to the keyboard so I'm gonna try my very best to not do that because that's always kind of embarrassing did I see he's dead now I'm not gonna sit here and claim I'm some sort of mouse and keyboard expert uh, but I just want to compare it to how I play uh, versus controller, you know what I mean? So I know my aim is gonna be a lot better, obviously. And this is uh, with more recoil, because controller players get less recoil in Battlefield 2042 compared to mouse and keyboard players. So this is with more recoil, and I know I'm still gonna have better aim. Regardless, I just wanna see how it goes, okay? So we're not gonna make too big of a deal of it, just gonna play a little bit. Only problem is, obviously we're gonna play against mostly other mouse and keyboard players that have more experience than me. So, we'll see how it goes. That guy is dead. Okay, got two of them. Should have gotten three actually, but that's okay. Let's get a little bit closer. Oh, what the? Where the hell did you come from? I think I saw more people. That's not the one that I meant. I saw another one. Maybe they're right here. There we go. Mouse and keyboard, thank you very much. I mean, I don't like to state the obvious, but the, the, the speed of which you can acquire targets with mouse and keyboard is... What kind of BS was that? I think my shots got blocked because of the stupid ammo crate. Give me a revive. Thank you. Okay, that's lucky. Quickly. Okay, there's somebody above us, I think. Let's see if I'm right. No, I'm not right. It is so easy to aim with mouse and keyboard compared to controller, I'm telling you guys. Come on. Okay, so I saw some people here. Quick target acquisition. Why can't I go up here? That, that has nothing to do with freaking mouse and keyboard. I just can't. Okay, so these guys were above me. Yeah, right there, right there. He was right there. I'm gonna wait for my uh, grappling hook to uh, respawn. He killed himself, I think. Damn it, damn it, again. Look at that, look how fast I can aim like this. It's unbelievable, and I'm not even joking as well. Where is everybody? That's a friendly. 
Okay, we're going to A1, I guess. We're gonna lose this anyway, but uh, we got a couple of nice kills. You know what's funny? Nobody who watches this video can claim that it's fake or anything like that because I always play on controller and now when I'm performing better on mouse and keyboard it is it, it has to be because of mouse and keyboard you know what I mean so that's that's the best part I'm playing on mouse and keyboard and I'm performing much better so what does that tell you like I said I already knew that because at least in Battlefield 2042 controller players just often don't stand a chance against mouse and keyboard players okay we no longer have the best gun in the game we now have the second best gun in the game in my opinion. The only problem with this gun is the uh, sprint to fire time is extremely, whoa, extremely slow. But other than that, it's really, really good. So let's see if we can uh, make use of the mouse and keyboard, if you will. And uh, try to slay with this gun because it also has 200 rounds. There we go. That's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. I like that. Now, one thing you will notice in this gameplay is that I will hardly get killed by any, like, PlayStation slash controller players. You will see. I will, I will almost never get killed because of controller players. Hold on. The problem with this gun is that you can be having a run-and-gun playstyle because of the slow uh, sprint to fire time. It's really, really annoying. And it also feels really unnatural, the amount. The amount of time it takes to go from sprinting to shooting with this gun is, is like laughably high. Look, look, look. For example, I'm sprinting, sprinting, and firing. Unbelievable. You see how long it takes before you can actually shoot? It's so annoying. My goodness. Don't worry, I got you. Yeah, I should use a different weapon. Okay, it is time for a different weapon. I actually don't know if this is a good gun anymore because I think it got nerfed pretty heavily. But uh, we're gonna try our best. Nobody's here. If somebody could spawn on me, that would be great. Okay, 2v2. Okay, they're over there. He's coming through here, I think. Bro, holy crap. Bro, you guys are getting outplayed by a... Mouse and keyboard noob. You should be ashamed of yourself. You guys are experienced mouse and keyboard players and I'm defeating you. Look at that. Come on, let's take this point. Come on. Okay, so we got this sector. Pretty proud of myself. That's really good. To finish the video off, I wanted to play Modern Warfare 2 or Modern Warfare 2019 because that is primarily where the debate takes place. However, I'm not gonna spend freaking 70 euros for Modern Warfare 2 or 60 euros for Modern Warfare 2019. This game is about to be four years old and it's still pretty much full price on PC. Absolutely ridiculous. So instead, we're going back to the original Modern Warfare 2. We're playing on the IW4X client, and this is PC only, so pretty much everyone I'm playing against is also on mouse and keyboard, and we're playing some sort of weird gun game, I believe. We're playing... This is gun game, but... Obviously some sort of modded version of gun game. What in the... What is going on? I have super speed for some reason. I don't know what's going on. I don't know. I don't have no idea what this is. What in the world?
Well. I wish I could tell you guys what's going on, but I have absolutely no idea. All I know is that I'm slaying while going 500 miles an hour. No, no! Still alive, still alive. Thank you, mouse and keyboard. What the hell is going on? No, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I have no idea what just happened there, but that was kind of fun, I guess. Akimbo 1887. Not as overpowered as they used to be, as you can see. What the f I really wish I could tell you guys what, what was going on, but all I know is that Mouse and keyboard, look at that! You think that was possible with controller? Hell no, I don't even know what's going on! What? No. No, he demoted me, you absolute... Painkiller. What the hell? I hope this makes for some entertaining video, guys, because this is too crazy for me, actually, but... I now have wall hacks? No, no, no! Look at that! That must be decent, because that didn't happen on my screen, but whatever. Okay, so there is one or two good guys? Or good players. And the rest are absolute bots. Look at this. I mean, it's a weird... Where the hell did you come from? It's like a weird uh, situation, this whole game. But it does provide a perfect example of why mouse and keyboard is so much better, in my opinion. Okay, that was actually kind of ironic right after I said that. It's much better. Explosive? What in the world? No! Oh! Galaxy actually killed me. I just noticed there are 140 levels to this. I don't know if I'm gonna complete this because it might take a little bit too long, but uh, it is fun. And I wanna play a game where at least I get a nuke, you know what I mean? Okay, let me get my health back. Suicide bombers. Oh right, I had this before. So when you die, you're gonna you blow up. What the hell? I didn't even see him. This is this is crazy. Why is everything a one shot kill? Got absolutely destroyed by my mouse and keyboard. Now you. Who? I don't see him. I don't see him. I don't see him.
Why is everybody just rushing me? Maybe they are on the shotgun or something. Why do I have explosive? And now I got wall hacks. I mean, I'll take that, don't get me wrong. I'll freaking take wall hacks, but... It's kinda unfair. Wall hacks, how is that even remotely fair? I'll take it though, don't get me wrong. Oh, now the wall hacks are gone again. Look at that. Oh, mouse and, you know what? I might just switch to mouse and keyboard. Just looking around and everything is just so much easier. Yeah, 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 again, that's that guy. That's that one freaking guy again. Could be wrong, by the way. Maybe these guys are bots. What the hell? I am an I am an AC-130 now with insane speed. What the hell is going on here? Oh, I'm reloading now. And now I have the main cannon of the AC-130. And I killed myself, and I killed him as well. I can't stand too close when killing them because I'm gonna kill myself. At least I know I'm in the lead. Okay, um, I guess this is the final streak. Throwing knife? There we go. Why are you not dying? There we go, now I won. So when you win this crazy ass gun game... What the hell? Oh, that's because I killed everybody with the nuke. What the hell was this? Be able to get a uh, chopper gun here. Here we go. Maybe I can get a nuke. I got a nuke. I don't believe it. Am I recording? Yes, I am. One of my first games playing Modern Warfare 2 on PC. And I freaking win. Unbelievable. Well, I'm really glad with that. And uh, I think we gonna end it with that. It wasn't spectacular. But t got the nuke. How more OG can you get? It wasn't that difficult, obviously, because we're playing on... Uh, what, what's this map called again? I forgot. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the video. One takeaway from this video is not to be uh, toxic between controller versus mouse and keyboard, even though it's pretty likely that it will happen. But basically, what I wanted to say, no crossplay anymore in the future for shooters. Or at least input-based matchmaking. I think we're all for that. Let me know your thoughts down below. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And with that being said, I see you guys next time. <laughs>